praise the lord everyone today we'll start with genesis 30 and leha named him asher for he said what a joy is mine now the other women will celebrate with me one day during the wheat harvest reuben found some men drakes growing in a field and brought them to his mother leha Rachel begged Leah please give me some of your son mandarks but Leah angrily replied was not it enough that you stole my husband now will you steal my son's mandarkness too Rachel answered i will let Jacob sleep with you tonight if you give me some of mandarks So that evening as Jacob was coming home from the fields Leah went out to meet him You must come and sleep with me tonight she said I have paid for you with some mandrakes that my son found So that no- that night he slept with Leah and go- God answered Leah's prayers She became pregnant again and gave birth to a fifth son for Jacob. She named him Issachar, for he she said, "God has rewarded me for giving my servant to my husband as a wife." Then Leah became pregnant again and gave birth to six son for Jacob. She named him Zebulun, for he said. God has given me a good reward now my husband will treat me with respect for i have given him six sons later she gave birth to a daughter and named her dinah then god remembered rekas plight and answered her prayers by enabling her to have children she became pregnant and gave birth to a son god has removed my disgrace she said and she named him joseph for she said may the lord add yet another son to my family soon after rachel had give birth to joseph jacob said to laban please relieve release me so i can go home to my own my own country Let me take my wives and children for I have earned them by serving you and let me on my way you certainly know how how, how hard I have worked for you please listen to me Laban replied I have become wealthy for the Lord has blessed me because of you tell me how much I will owe you whatever it is i will pay it jacob replied you know how how hard i have worked for you and how your flocks and herds have grown under my care you had little indeed it before i came but your wealth has increased enormously the lord has blessed you through everything i have done but now what about me When can I start providing for my own family? What wages do you want? Laban asked again. Jacob replied, "Don't give me anything, just do this one thing and I will continue to tend and watch over your flocks. Let me inspect your flocks today and remove all the sheep and goats that are speckled, speckled or spotted along with all the black sheep." give this to me as my wages in the future when you check on the animals you have given me as my wages you will see that i have i have been honest if you find in my flock any goats without speckles or spots any sheep that are not black you will know that i have stolen them for you All right Laban replied I will be as you say Amen God bless you all